much for watching the Shikama Live Show with your host, Shikama. Today we're going to talk about bullion pools and certificate. When you buy into a bullion pool or certificate, you become a creditor of the bullion bank storing your precious metals. Just as when you deposit your currency at a bank, the bank doesn't keep your dollars separate from everyone else's dollars. The bank simply tells you in your bank statement or online how much it owes you. Essentially, your wealth is transmuted into digits in a computer. Legally, however, when you buy into a gold pool or certificate program, the bank becomes the owner of your precious metals. If the bullion bank gets into financial trouble, imagine that, it can sell your gold to maintain its assets at a level where it won't get shut down and where it will avoid a run on the bank. In that instance, you won't be paid back in gold, but rather in currency. Less currency than the value of the gold the bank owed you. Because logically a bank in trouble almost certainly would be forced to sell your assets at fire sale prices. If you live in a country with some kind of bank deposit protection, such as the Federal Deposit Insurance Corporation in the United States or Financial Services Corporation scheme in the UK, your gold will not be covered. That's because deposit insurance only applies to currency. Meaning that, in the likely event of a bank crash, currency deposits are safer than unallocated gold. So why would anyone invest in one of these types of sketchy accounts? Simple. It's cheap and easy, and everyone loves cheap and easy, right? Purchasing gold or silver through pools or certificate programs is cheaper than purchasing a like amount of physical gold or silver primarily because most pools or certificate hold the metal in unallocated storage, which means your metals are commingled with everyone else's metal. What's yours is not yours, and in the event that your bullion bank goes under, it's theirs. If you agree to store precious metals, take a look at any bonded or insured silver and gold valuating options around the country or even the world. These vault storage options are both segregated and allocated, which means that your metals are stored separately in your name and are owned by you alone. If you go under, your metals stay in your name and you will never be beholden to a bank. Thank you for watching the Shikama Live Show.